Organizers of next month's celebration to mark the 20th anniversary of the Dayton Peace Accords have a big name coming to town as a part of the event. Former President Bill Clinton has confirmed he's coming to Dayton. Our Lisa Smith has more. Lisa. That's right, Natasha. Organizers of the event are thrilled that President Bill Clinton is coming to Dayton next month, and they say that this was not something they had to convince the president to do. He wants to be here for this event. President Bill Clinton was there when the nations shook hands to end the more than three-year war in Bosnia. Twenty years later, he'll be here in Dayton again to mark the place of those long negotiations. It's big. Uh, the fact that he chose to be here, uh, you know, I, I think uh, shows us how much he still cares for the country of Bosnia Herzegovina. Uh, and for us here in Dayton, the site that uh, where they, they negotiated the accords. Dayton City Commissioner Matt Joseph co-chairs the committee that's organizing the event. He says he knows the president is busy with the Clinton Foundation, charities, and the fact that his wife is running her own presidential campaign. But this was something Clinton wanted to do. You know, he, he was uh, very interested from the very beginning. His staff told us that... Uh, He's proud of his role in the Accords, and he really did want to be here. Even though the actual accord was signed in Paris, the talks took place at the Hope Hotel at Wright Pat. The agreement reached November 21st, 1995. Commissioner Joseph says it was a time when all of Dayton came together to support the negotiations and peace among the fighting nations. People lined up with, uh, on the outside of the base gates with candlelight vigils, prayer services, uh, holding hands, singing demonstrations, encouraging demonstrations. Now, President Clinton is scheduled to deliver the keynote address at a luncheon on the first day of the two-day event that begins November 19th. A number of international dignitaries will also be on hand from Bosnia and Croatia. Natasha? Thanks a lot, Lisa. The Dayton Peace Accords at 20 kicks off November 18th with a dedication of the Ambassador Richard Holbrook Plaza at the corner of Salem and Edwin C. Moses Boulevard. Ambassador Holbrook's widow will be a part of that event. Also, his son, filmmaker David Holbrook, will be in town during the two-day event to screen a movie about his father called The Diplomat. Now, other events will be at the Art Institute and a reef laying and luncheon at the Hope Hotel at Wright Pat.